Um, Bunny Nim, give us the previously on. Uh, I have no idea. Come on. Do Let's it. see. So we were in the uh, weird mouth dungeon. Close. And we were going to go through a door and we got attacked by a bunch of plaque monsters from the teeth. And then we went shopping. <laughs> That's backwards. <laughs> I remember things the way I want to. So I'll give you a hint. Yeah. You teleported Dr. Pox out of danger to which he immediately ran directly back into danger. Oh god, yeah, we were in like that little corridors of the jaw and the skull thing and then um I don't remember where we ended off though. I'm a sleepy. The part oh, I we're inside a big giant skull. I know that. And there's a bunch of corridors and um mm-hmm. we're in a book guys loser. jumping out at us. What? We're in a book. We're also in a skull in a book. Rabbit looks so sad now. We are in the mind of Mencia. Mencia, yeah. <laughs> we were both gonna say that dumb shit. Uh, uh, Lord Lord Cromwell. But we yeah, found but that... out through Nim's visions, we were able to put together that the Lich had actually switched minds with Cromwell because we came into the book wanting to go to the Lich's ritual. And the old and Lich Cromwell switch. Who actually did it with the Lich switch. So I was listening to a noob oh, show and switch. Franks and, and Noob really gave Kevin shit about his voices, but that dude knows the story we're playing. So you know what? Mm-hmm. In his defense, <laughs> fuck y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you a nice fucking rabbit? Why? What? Why not? It's a, it's a, what are you talking about, Noob? <laughs> Noob's you- turned into Black Noir I- from the boys. <laughs> <laughs> I got um, I got a new shirt. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, your eyes are just as soulless as they've always been. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> smile on that thing is what gets me. Yeah. You it's- can't fake eyes, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's real happy. It's uh, it's kind of creepy. Twitch- I can keep looking at it. Twitch your nose for me, Matt. Yeah. <laughs> You're turning new bond. You know he's a furry. Stop it. Look at these ears. <laughs> yeah, if you shake your head real fast, do the ears move? No. no. But you can but you can grab them. What about the Dang jiggle it? physics? <laughs> no. <laughs> Look at how pleased he was with himself, that dumb joke. <laughs> <laughs> the funniest bat has been is uh, at the uh, rabbit form. I don't know. I was um, so I was moving our our, our RSS feed to Anchor because it's free. Yeah. And uh, so I've been listening to old episodes yet again to make sure they're working. They're they're not really. I mean, they're there, but they're not video on some of them. So it's, it's going to be a lot more work, I think. But it'll save us money. Um, Drunk Matt had its moments back then. Drunk, hey, Drunk Matt had drinking. its moments. Yeah. The yeah, only problem with drunk Matt. Been pro drunk yeah. Matt. Here we go. The only Breaks. the only problem with drunk Matt is eventually it becomes incomprehensible. Yeah. But it's still just continually falling out of his mouth, this rambling, <laughs> drunken rant. That's, we don't understand what you're saying. That's how you know the party started, man. Yeah. yeah. I, I need to be outside at that point. Mm-hmm. And away from people. <laughs> no, I need all. I need more people away from small children. Yeah, as soon yeah. as you boom and, power, it's over. Yeah. And the elderly. Yeah, well, yeah, thin the hurts. Ah, the elderly could use a drink or two. They're all really uptight. Mm-hmm. We need a Patreon goal so that um, we can get Matt a bottle of liquor every week. No, he's an adult. He can buy his own fucking yeah, liquor. Like, I'm giving him all the liquor. <laughs> I work across the street. I, 
basically beside a liquor store. So it's kind of good. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you were beside carrot a liquor, liquor? <laughs> The what? Is there like carrot vodka? Mm, it's it's cucumber vodka. So probably sure. Maybe. Sure like maybe. Cucumber vodka, vodka is refreshing and good. It, but it, it can be a nice, light, refreshing drink. Yes. Mm-hmm. Nice you. in a Bloody Mary. Yeah, whatever. carrot vodka. Yeah, Bloody Mary. Yeah. Mm-mm. Don't see. No. Told you it's a good idea. No. <laughs> Don't just say no. I said no. I mean, and you know. Um, well, there's candy corn vodka, and those mm-hmm. are shaped like carrots. That mm. should also oh, not exist. Kevin. Chalky. <laughs> I just don't want a cloyingly su- sweet drink anymore. I'm just tired of them. Mm. Yeah. I don't really I don't want to like drink anymore. Tasting straight molasses. Did you drink too much, like- Nuke? No, I just like other things. Mm. I like gin. So you decided to get oh, no. judgy about it? Is that what it? Yeah. Mm-hmm. It it's the salmon all over again. I don't want to hear it. Fuck salmon. Salmon's a shitty fish. It. It's oily. You are super opinionated these Look at that tilapia days. eating motherfucker over there. I Look at it. <laughs> I like the shit out tilapia before I eat salmon. Uh, I, I doubt right, I've good. ever eaten tilapia. Good. That leaves more salmon for me. Tilapia looks like an alien foot. I don't. I don't want to eat that. It's just the two big dangly toes. Oh, nobody wants that. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Frank, draw me up. Draw me an alien that's got tilapia feet. Let's uh. There you let's go. Give still you gotta, I still got to draw Jeff and um. Yes. In, in his character creation mode. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you can knock out tilapia feet in an afternoon. Uh, Shit. Uh, I can't knock anything out in an afternoon anymore. By the time I get home, I am fucking dead. Toker's asking for some Hieronymus Bosch bullshit up in mm-hmm. <laughs> Hey, listen, you leave him alone. That's the best artist. Oh, yeah. I have his autograph. I, don't, I doubt that. <laughs> Press X to doubt. <laughs> We're moving right along because I don't get the references. Uh, <laughs> He's dead. He's been dead a long time. I made I really weird paintings. You've seen them before. I'm sure. Um, Birdman wearing a pot, eating a body. Uh, yum, yeah, yum, people yum, people yum. living in a giant fish with a beak. tree man. Yeah, I went to college. Yeah, and not <laughs> living in a pot. <laughs> I'm sure that was on somebody's wall that I bought weed from. But so. Probably. Yeah. Ooh, Sell man. vodka? That'd be a good, that triptych would be a good black light poster. Mm. Let's go redo it in uh, velvet. <laughs> we ready? Yeah, yeah. I do. whatever. I forgot. It's combat. Everybody. Everybody. Hey, hey look, Max. I can stick my tongue out. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So let's let's go to the map. Glad you're enjoying yourself. <laughs> He's having a ball. At least some. I'm having a good time. <laughs> fucking weirdo <laughs> just stop it no keep doing it does something for me <laughs> you're awakening things in new oh awake. shit I forgot Naga yeah, yeah that's what that. I meant to say damn it Kevin you let us down yeah well, well why did you forget this part yeah, well, dude, I was, I was tempted to be like Dorian. Is there anything you would like to add to what happened last week? No, I don't remember shit from my last week. Like how you opened the door and a dream naga came around the corner. Mm. No, that doesn't sound like me at all. Ooh, dream naga is a great metal band name. It's probably taken. You might have out. said that last time too. Sounds like it's. <laughs> yeah, it could be. I don't know, yeah, it sounds like a, seven, 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 that's what it sounds like it should be. Yeah, it sounds um, more like a prog rock thing. I was thinking, uh, Miami Connection. What was her name? Dragon Force. Dra- oh, Dragon Force. So that's an actual thing on yeah. PSFRD20. Not yeah, Dragon yeah. Force. Dragon Force is the through the fire and flames. Oh no, Dragon Sound. Dragon, Dragon Sound. Sound. Yeah. yeah. Toker, this isn't actually a uh, Dream Naga from the, the book, is it? Don't look at it. Don't look at I'm it. I'm not look. I'm not looking at it. <laughs> Let me just Google the monster. Not what well, <laughs> Dream Naga is. I wanted a band, and I got the information. <laughs> Uh, it is from the book. 
I will not. I haven't looked at it. I want to. I'm sure you Ooh, do. Dream Naga music. Let's hear it. We can't. You can. I can. Uh, <laughs> good point. <laughs> yes. Yes, noob. Put some more strain on your headphones <laughs> that pushed us back 45 minutes. It wasn't the headphones. It was the outlet. It was the wrong USB port. Suck my dick, freaks. No. Mm-hmm. All right. As many times as I have to tell you, no. Weekly. He's hostile tonight. I don't he know does a lot of get, covers, by the way. I where you get this Dream Naga. Who made you this way, Noob? Are, a quick question. Are sure. you moving things on your screen, or am I hallucinating black dots in the map? No, it's just some sort of weird um, sort of like... I see it, too. It's just... Okay. Yeah, when you Good. stream, you can only actually process so many pixels, so it's like bit crunching some parts to save space. No, I think that's a holdover from another room. Like <laughs> I tried to make the flies really big so it would look uh, maybe, but it's like it's yeah. They're just I, really big flies. Yeah. <laughs> I honestly thought that I might have had bugs behind my computer screen. Ooh, it was ew. freaking me out. Ew. That's just mm. yeah, you need to sleep more. You won't get that if you buy real estate from Bunny Nim. Hello, Steven. <laughs> no bugs. Right, Bunny Nim? Oh, that's correct. Unless you're into bugs. You like that? <laughs> we got bug houses. I don't want them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, then. You really give me initiative. Days. Roll initiative. Roll initiative. Ooh, that's, Ooh, that's a chunky dice. Ideal. Ew, I don't yeah. know which one I want to roll yet. You got a second, yeah. Doctor Pox. Um, I've got a five. Nim. Eighteen. I'm gonna go with eight because you said that first. Uh, <laughs> Vladros. Twelve. Dorian. Teen. Three. <laughs> Three. No, thirteen. I was saying the teen part. Never mind. Yeah. Uh, I'm on. 23. <laughs> Fuck you. We're on 18. Sonder. 11. All right. Uh, as Dorian opens the door, you can see a shock expression on his face. And Amon, you are the first to react. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm not used to that. I am not either. I thought you lied <laughs> about that initiative because you were like, fuck it. I'm going first for a change. <laughs> as fun as that would be, I don't think that's what happened. Uh, I guess move me up to <laughs> where's my annotations? Up to here. 5, 10, 15, 20. That's 15 feet. 25. Fuck it. Put me here. I got 30 foot of movement now. <laughs> that's one move then. And I'm assuming this thing isn't undead. Uh, it is not undead. Just always a good check. Uh, I'm going to pull up my shield, and then I'm going to use one of my minutes of armor to give me a plus two to my armor. Okay. Yeah, that's my turn. Wait, no, I still got a, I still got a fucking. Sorry, this has been a minute since we played. Yada yada yada. It's been two weeks. I'm also going to cast Iron Skin. I'm going to cast Spell and activate my Fervor for a swift action. Oh, or not okay. my Fervor, my armor ship. Yeah, you see him run into the room and cast Spells. Uh, <clears throat> did um, Dorian or Noob or anybody kind of scream out what they're seeing, maybe? Yeah, I'll definitely do that. Ah, thing. I don't know what this is. <laughs> Big evil snake lady. Okay, so move me. I'm going to have to move because I need to be able to see things. Move me here, and let me do a knowledge check. What do I, what do I need? Let me look that up. Um, planes. All right. <laughs> yeah, I rolled a 19. That gives me a 40. Oh, um, you are somewhat familiar with Nagas and can instinctively tell that this is one of dreams, Mother. Um, which might be why you're seeing it here. Uh, 
Dream Naga's fly through dreamscapes as part of an unknowable plan to alter the destiny of the multiverse. Uh, maybe this one is here being subservient for some reason. Um, you know that it's uh, magical in nature. It has spells that normally affect the minds of mortals. Um, you do know that its bite is poisonous. Um, and outside of that, um, there's not a whole lot as far as like special offenses or defensives go. These are just big, powerful kind of magic casting, mind affecting serpent creatures. Okay. Um, then I will shout all that out to the group as I remember it. And then um, I'm use my standard to cast invisibility on myself. Mm, before you do that, you do know that it does have the ability to see invisibility. Oh, well, that's, yeah, that, thank you. I would, yeah, sorry. So, that's all right. I'm going to not do what I was just going to. Yeah, not. Gonna I could have let you do it, but you rolled really high on that. They have, uh, did, did they have, does it have SR or anything? I'm assuming. They do not have SR. Uh, okay. Well, I'm going to, uh, You know what? I'm going to cast haste on the group. Ooh. There you go. Good idea, Matt. Very good idea, Matt. Haste is always welcome. Damn, um, I had a super slow plan. <laughs> <laughs> well, they do say that haste makes waste, but... Um, All right, and I was going to fill the chamber with waste. And uh, after I cast haste, I'm going to shift to there. That's what I was waiting on. Yeah, I was trying to figure out where I needed to go to get out of the way. I don't want to be. <laughs> I needed to be able to have to go through some things or people. You know. We get mm-hmm. it. You're a chicken. I'm squishy. I have an AC of 12. He's not a chicken. He's survival oriented. Chicken. And that's my turn. Okay. Uh, creature goes it will move here provoking an attack from Amun how many times does he leave my threatened square because I have multiple attacks of opportunity it only provokes once per type of action all right well then I'm going I'm going to whip it whip it good well correct that's an 18 on the die uh, that is like a 30, 18 plus 16 to hit. Okay, I'll do the math. Yeah, that hits. Oh, I was trying to th- <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I that I hit. <laughs> Look at Noob. You expect him to do simple mathematics in that state? <laughs> yes, you beat you beat his AC. You do eight damage, loser. <laughs> or I do eight damage. All right. We'll then attempt to cast defensively. Don't you do that. Oh, yeah. And then I need... Does it have SR? Oh, yeah. That's what I meant to look at. I need... um, Oh, I've got... Oh, do you see why there's too many people in there? Are you happy now, Frakes? Oh, I do see that. Thank you. I am happy. Zoom in on that rat. Looky there. New pucks. I was yeah. like, doppelganger. I was like, there's two people out of range, but there's only one because that's the old Dr. Pox. And the new Dr. <laughs> Pox is in range of this ability. Oh, no. <laughs> I need everybody but Sonder to give me will saves, and then I will check for you, noob, if there's any SR and if I need to beat it. Will save. Uh, there is. Will save. Quick question Has it been a full Funny. minute since our last combat? Yes. Oh, right. I am not fatigued. Uh, noob, your SR is 23, if I remember correctly. Uh, 20, 20. Oh, if it's 20, then I got it on the nose. That's fine. I got a 29 will save. Okay. So you make the save. And this This, is, uh, um, this is a will save. Will save. Enchantment? Mind affecting enchantment. Enchantment. I've got a, I've got a a middling, uh, 16. You fail. I'm nervous. Yeah. 
<laughs> All right. 25 All right. for fly I've roast. Got, I got a 31. All right. Dorian? Uh, 19. So only Dr. Pox fails. Uh, you're stunned for two rounds. Oof. Ouch. Oh. I'm sorry. Stunned for one round. One round. Okay. Oh, that's not so bad. Yeah. And hey, Matt, is this thing evil? Unfortunately, he drops the bomb he was holding and explodes at his feet. Mm-hmm. Is it evil, Toker? No. All right. Well, that's yeah. its go. It is now ledge. Nope. Uh, Dorian's go. Okay. Um. Let's see. Moved up against the wall. Shit. Uh, 9, 10, 15. Uh, move me. Uh, you see that diagonal? Like right beside it you can annotate on the screen oh yeah i forgot about that sorry do 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 uh, it has reach so all right i have 30 foot of extra movement so, so. oh that's right you're hasty yeah so you're able to move around and get into well i mean you still to get base to base with it yeah let me double check that it has reach. You still have enough extra movement. Actually, to never mind. It's one of the large creatures that do not have reach. Oh, okay, good. All right, well, uh, hopefully someone will take up the opposite position, but in the meantime, I'll make an attack on it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> rolling a natural one, of course. Oh. Right up right the gate. Percentiles. <laughs> That's how you know it's going to be a good night. Uh, let's see. Ninety-seven. Ninety-seven. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. Huh. <laughs> That's never a good sound from a master. Huh. Mm. What are you expecting? Something good to happen? Somehow you stab through the creature and your magical energies and its magical energies intertwine. You're automatically affected by one of his spells. Ooh. Uh, synesthesia. Um, okay. You over, mm. your, your senses become overstimulated uh, by its presence. Uh, and for some reason, noise will trigger burst of color. Smells will create weird sounds and so on. Uh, you now move at half speed, have a 20% miss chance on attacks, and take a minus four penalty to AC. Oof. Ouch. Uh, AC skill checks and reflex saves. Neat. No, <laughs> no um, save on that at all? No, he rolled a 97. All right, very good. Uh, <laughs> but instead of making it last its level, it will only last three rounds. I, t- I can taste sound, man. Yeah, you've, you've basically... Uh, I licked the toad. You licked the toad, it. and now you're tripping balls. <laughs> Vladros. All right. Uh, Vladros would like to, if possible, since he is not fatigued. 10, 15. Tell me if this movement here that I, tri- that I amputate will avoid an attack of opportunity. Or will I need to roll an acrobatics check to avoid? Um, just because of how I've drawn the map, I will say you can either roll acrobatics or I can roll percentiles and on a 20% it would provoke. Well, it doesn't have reach. Right? It doesn't, but but that square is not a full square. It's not a full That's, square. Oh, okay. So he would either need to squeeze to get over there or move into like a mon space. It's just because it's in a weird... Well, if, if squeezing is double, is half speed, I could still... Oh, you're, you're hasted. So yeah, you're yeah. hasted. Yeah. You could try I, that. Yeah, you could do that then. All right. I will, as I charge past Nim, I will kick off of that wall in a sick parkour move as I... Give me that acrobatics. Bellow my rage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that acrobatics roll is... Uh, my computer just... I hit the wrong button and it went wonky. 
Uh, 17. Close enough. Uh, 30 to jump. Describe your cool parkour. Uh, I just, uh, parkour. just, as I'm running through, I snarl in rage. And um, leaping off of that little corner piece, I will bring Shashka down in an overhand chop to land in flanking with Dorian. Okay. And it sounds and looks super badass. Uh, that is a natural 16 to threaten a crit. Yes, threatens a crit. That total? No, total is 34. Okay, yeah, I needed that total to see if it actually still hit. Roll to confirm. Roll to confirm is a 28. That'll confirm. Yeah. I've missed you, Vlad Roast. You're my number one guy. That's a 23 damage. Okay. 23 damage taken. Oh, wait. Um, because of my abilities, because of my um, fey blood, it needs to give me a DC 20. Uh, will save. Okay. Unless it is immune to mind affecting compulsion effects. It is not, but it does have a gnarly will save and Okay. It, okay, cool. It is I mean, not confused. It's not it's not a give me uh on, on the DC that high, but it's it'd be hard for him to fail it. Cool. Yeah, so um, he's not confused by my sick ass moves. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so that brings us to Sonder. What sick ass moves have you got? Mm-hmm. I'm going to move Sonder. This is the door, correct? Yes. All right. So move Sonder into the space of the door, please. And um, does this creature have SR? Nope. Okay, well, 26 to overcome Noob's SR and Your... prayer. Okay. Woo. Yay. Staple. Say a prayer to the Lady Saren Ray to protect my friends and not protect my foes. I will, even though I do not believe in the... the if, Anybody if ask you what you believe in? I will <laughs> still make it. use of their abilities. <laughs> Anything else there, Sonder? Um, uh, at the moment, no. That is pretty much uh, all I can do. Dr. Pops? And a standard. You are stunned. I am stunned. I'm on. All right. Uh, full round attack. Okay. With haste. Oh, but before I do that, swift action, and I will give myself 1d4 bleed damage. Or was this thing immune to poison? Nope. Or acid? Nope. All right, cool. Then yeah, it wasn't a Nim's turn at all. And don't Double forget checking. that uh, prayer affects your attack roll and damage. Mm-hmm. And haste. Take... I have all that checked in. Cool. So Chevron that's three forward. damage to me. Okay. None of that. And then first attack is. Mm, 16, 23. Nope. Mm. All right. That sucks. Uh, natural 19 plus 16. So I think that hits. That will hit. And then. Mm, 24 to hit. No. All right. So one hit. Mm-hmm. Ooh. So that is. That's scary. That is 12, 16 points of damage. 16 total. Gotcha. Crack it with a whip. Crack that whip. All right. So. Uh, Nim. All right. I am going to try something. I'm sorry, Noob. You were done. Full round attack. Swift action. That's it. Yep. 
All right, so I need a. Um, I got a. You said it does not have SR, correct? No. Mem okay, didn't listen sorry. during his turn either. <laughs> just clarify. Um. All right, so give me a uh, fortitude save from the creature. All righty. So I take out uh, a needle and a dried eyeball. Ugh. 17. Yay, you fail. You send, uh, I send racking pains to the target's body. Because of the pain, the affected creature takes negative two penalty to AC, attacks, melee attack, melee damage rolls, reflex saving throws, and must succeed at a concentration check. DC equal to the spell, which is 21, to cast spells. However, if you spend a move action screaming as loudly as possible, it can act without any other penalties remainder of its turn. Oh, okay. Yeah. So move action to get rid of it? It doesn't get rid of it. It just gets rid of it that turn. It lasts 10 rounds. Oh, okay. Oh, and what's the spell wow. called? Howling Agony. Oh, that hurts. It's pretty brutal, man. That is a brutal spell. That is gnarly. And it doesn't have the evil descriptor. <laughs> Weird, that. Yeah, it's one of the few that I took out. That was a level three spell I took out of that Necromancer book I got way back when. <laughs> so not evil. Not evil. You had to use an eyeball with a pin in it as a, okay, I got you. A dried eyeball. It is. Mm-hmm. Uh, it does it's have the death it. and pain descriptors, but not evil. It's an ethically sourced eyeball. It is. A, I mean, it could be like a frog's eyeball or something. It doesn't say it's, you know. He pulled it out of a hobo, and those people just don't matter. Jesus Christ. Ho, a ho who? <laughs> no, you can donate body parts to science. Or, or magic. To, or to pay off your mafia debts. Or hobos, <laughs> hobos will give them for liquor. Dude, enough of the hobo shit. Yeah, seriously. It's not 1950 anything. <laughs> uh, I got a couple dames. <laughs> you know, I got all my tummy gun. Um, I'm well, going to attack, over here. I'm gonna attack you, Terrence, for the hobo comments. Uh, let's <laughs> go in with the bite attack. Ooh, almost. Almost a crit. That's still a 30. Even yeah, that hits. Okay. Let me find all my D8s. I don't have enough D8s. Uh, well, we're waiting. Give me our fortitude save. Waiting for what? All the, I have to do all this. I only have two D8s, and I have to roll way more than that. Uh, fifteen. So you take 33 damage from the bite. I. And you're dazed for one round from the poison. Okay. Uh, dazed is the bad one. Uh, dazed is the, the creature is unable to act normally. Dazed creature can take no actions, but has no penalty to AC. I already have an AC, but... <laughs> yeah, they don't stack. And then, so that means only Noob and um, Freaks can take attacks of opportunity as it... Well, let's see. I mean, let me acrobatics this. Let's see if they get the attacks of opportunity. <laughs> you don't use your move action to scream so you could... Uh... <laughs> I'm not. I'm going to roll a nat 20 on the acrobatics because that's where I wanted it. Yeah, but what's the score? 41. Oh, you beat me. So beat your CMD, Franks? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And what's his movement at half? So it was minus twos to uh, attack unless you scream, right? Attack, yeah, attack. Damage, reflex, and spell. You can't cast spells. Mm-hmm. Well, a, a mischance to cast spells. Yeah, oh, yeah, you had to concentration check or whatever. Yeah. That is the Dream Nagas go. 
Uh, blah, 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 blah. Dorian, you are unable to act. Give me another fortitude save. Um, 22. That might be the cure. It's close. Yes. So after this round, you can act normally. You are able to stave off the poison for the remainder of the turns. Huzzah. Ah. Uh, Vladros. Okay, Vladros is going to take the long way around with all of his speed and get to here. And when he gets to here, give me the acrobatics this time. <laughs> Why? Because Cause fuck you, that's why. <laughs> because that to there to avoid the attack of opportunity. Oh, that space that. All right, sure. I'll Here, give you the there. acrobatics. That's where I was going. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I thought it was even wider than the other one. But that's all good. It's a natural eighteen. Yeah, you're fine. Plus a bunch. You like rolling what? dice? Shut up and roll them. Wish that was my attack roll, but here's my attack roll. Not uh, th- not threaten a crit, but it is a 31 to hit. That'll still hit. And that is a D10 plus ooh, ooh. 28 damage. Jesus. Jesus. Cheese and crackers. Sonder. I feel like we skipped Nim. No, mm-hmm. he's at the top. Right. Go right after you. Mm-hmm. Uh, he casts that evil spell that's not evil. Yeah, I feel mm-hmm. like I did go faster than I did last time, but that's that's cool. That's because Dorian's dazed. Mm. And uh, Kevin was stunned. Right. Uh, I am going to uh, cast Bless. Uh, so that gives everyone uh, another plus one on attack rolls, and it stacks with with prayer. And uh, plus one against saving throws against fear effects, which I don't know if that'll happen or not. And nice. then I'm going to move here. Bitty bitty bop. And that'll be my turn. Actually, one more. Hello? Oh, I thought you meant you were going to do one more thing. No, no, no. So I wasn't looking at the screen. One more squall, (laughs) please. I was like, is this a joke I'm not getting? (laughs) And that's me. That'll do it. A second dream naga. A little cubby hole. It's full of spiders. Ah! <laughs> Doctor Pox. Snapping out of my uh, stupor. You are covered uh, in uh, your own urine, and there's a small pile of tiny rat pellets behind you. Hey. <laughs> That's how I always wake up. Uh, in real I life. will move to that square, please. Bomb this some bitch. And then I will be tossing a bomb. Excluding uh all of my companions. Uh does a 26 hit his touch AC. Yes. All right. Well, then he will be taking a crappy roll. Yay. <laughs> 15 points of damage. That well, was a crappy Fire roll. Fire damage. 
The damage is dealt. The creature still stands or slithers. It's a snake. It's flying. Um, <clears throat> you should leave now. I'm on. Oh, I should be able to hit him from there, right? You got a uh, reach. Oh, yeah. I'll hit him. All right, cool. So I'm going to drop my shield. And full round attack again. First attack is a miss. You sure? Yes. Okay. Ooh, second attack is a 20, 30. I don't know that number. It is. Okay. So it's one attack and then last attack. Ooh, that's also a hit. So two attacks. I also take my bleed damage to keep my acid rolling, which is a four. So that's awesome. Mm -hmm. so, and then damage. So two D ten. Come on. Okay, there we go. Two D ten plus two D six. I bust out the calculator for this one. I'm impressed you haven't tried to trip the snake yet. Because it doesn't have legs. I know. Just so I'm impressed. It's also flying. <laughs> Aha! Tripped. Oh, I missed 30, it. Flying. 38 damage between two attacks. Noob. You don't. I don't get to say this to you often. Describe your kill. Woohoo! I uh, want to wrap my whip around its neck and slam its head into a rock. There are no okay. rocks. Oh, it's the still attacks alive. are negated. It's still alive. Ah. <laughs> Slam its head into the ground. Yeah, cool. Uh, I yeah. told you you should have left. Its body uh, robs and 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 withers for a, for a moment, and then, like tendrils of shadow, it slowly dissipates and vanishes. I, I search its pockets first. It doesn't have any pockets. Well, it's got one. It's got God's pocket. A cloaca. We're also not here in physical form. Ah. <laughs> I mean, you guys are left here in the aftermath. There is, uh, now that I'm realizing, there's a door here. Sacre blue. And then you can see the map the rest of the way. is pretty self-explanatory. What do you do? Is that uh, is that little cubby over there where Sonder is? Is that a dead end, or does mm -hmm. it? Con okay. Well, I'm all for opening doors. I mean, for someone else Whoa. opening doors. Ledros will peek around here, around the the corner, just to uh, check to see if there's anything still waiting. I cast you or cure light wounds on myself. So are you? Are you okay? You did you get hurt? Ooh, not to be the hey, we have homework guy, but um, wild magic. Oh, you are that guy. You really are that guy. I didn't say it during combat because I just remembered it now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that may, that doesn't make you less that guy. It's okay. We forgot about it last time, but I've kind of played. I went back and listened, and I'm giving you all negative effects. Not at all. Smoking. No, that's not what's going to happen. There's more rooms to this, so it'll, it's, it's still liable to come up. We are just in the head still, so maybe it's fine. Yeah, we're going to be in real trouble around the knees. Yeah. yeah. You see, before you were stuck in the large first. intestine, a, a large yellow bus. <laughs> no! All of the corpses of children. Oh, <laughs> it's the dark time on. That's dark, dude. So what it's are we doing? Damage. I say we go through the door. So we're we're first off, are you okay? Uh, are you hold on. Right. Hold on. Uh, yeah. That's that's the good stuff. Okay. All right. Now it's starting to hurt. Yes, heal me. <laughs> <laughs> 
I pass you a potion of cure moderate. All right. Uh, and it would be um, plus eight. Okay. Sixteen. <laughs> this way looks uh, to circle around to another probably dead end. Possibly another door. We just want to check this door here that we see or explore around the rest of this cranium. I don't know. I'm not even sure what we're looking for. A way out. More clues. Because More we're not clues. where we're supposed to be. Or are we? No, we figured out we are where we're supposed to be because the lich switched minds with mm. Lord Cromwell. Right, but so all I got that's was, why we went into his head. All I got was a single vague memory earlier when I touched something and just didn't tell me much of anything. Hmm. Got a couple well, of good the, ones. So. That uh, that makes me wonder if there's this wall here in the middle of the skull, perhaps there is something in the middle of the skull that we could touch and get more memories. Instead of going through that door, we see if there's a doorway to this central portion. Oh, let's Shoot. search around. Let's search around this room where the Naga was. We do some oh, fine. Checks. No, I'll do Detect a perception magic, check anything. for traps as well. I can't tell which way is which. Which, which way are you talking about? To the north or to the south? To the north. Oh, around... Okay. Around the back. I got a uh, 26 okay. perception. Um, you do not. I'll, I'll go ahead and, and cut some corners here for you guys. Uh, you make yourself, take yourself around here, Vladros and Dorian, everybody else in tow. See where it kind of covers back into this area here, and there are three doors now. Mm. There's a uh, Oops. This want me to move my light barrier, not the door. Mm. I can't see any doors. Yeah, you know, there's a there's a door. Oh, okay, I see it now. <laughs> this is a door. And then there's a door here. Alright. Well, Vladros' main focus was to see if there was something in this central pillar, I guess, is what that is now. Um, well, see if there was a secret way in or something. But If it's a cut skull, I imagine it's an, an enormous spinal cord. But <laughs> or a tumor. Could be a tumor. Ooh. It's not a tumor. It might be a tumor. You don't know that. So which door do we wish to go through? Just to mm. give you all the uh, where you've been so far kind of look. I say we burst in both sides and hope it's the same room. <laughs> so we're going to split up and try to surprise no, no, it's the same something. room. We wouldn't be splitting up. If say we go this. through the door we were initially going to go through. All right, that's fine. All right. <laughs> Two for that. I stand by it. If you don't want to try anything daring, I guess we'll do the safe way. <laughs> I don't think anything is safe. Here. We're in the tomb in, in the body of uh, the skeleton of a demon. Oh. Uh Dorian, are you gonna be the one that opens the door? I suppose so. Let me check it for traps. Um 25. It does not appear to be trapped. It does appear to be locked. Uh, let me give it a go. Come back, come back. back. <laughs> Try again. There you go. Uh, that is 30. Uh, like the other locks, you get in there and you fiddle around and then you, you find the the sounds and the feel that you want and the lock begins to turn and then everyone needs to give me a will save. Uh, <laughs> oh, wait, no. Oh, yeah, no. Nat 20. Is it an enchantment? or uh... Nope. This is Nat that memory 20 burst again. 24. Okay. I got a uh, oh, 20... stuff is gone. 
Oh yeah, all of our things are gone. Hold on. I think I got fifteen for me. I think I got a twenty-two. Okay. Twenty-three, actually. Sorry. Anyone 13. who got anyone who got over a twenty will be able to uh, make sense of the the visions that pop in. Not me. Mm, okay. Yeah, Fourteen. This, this time, not only do you see uh, the vision, the there's a, there's a fear uh, to it, but the fear is not coming from you. You can see this this giant slab, gray, basically coffin, and inside you see Lord Cromwell um, fighting to get out as your hands now who also look like Cromwell are pushing him down and the 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 tomb is being sealed um and he looks up to see what Ratama looked like before but you can tell that this is just a mindless controlled puppet uh so for those of you who can put the visions together can tell that that Ratatama took over Cromwell's body and is in it and then made a duplicate of himself to perform the ritual. Uh, um, Nim and who else passed? I did. You weren't with the party yet. Nim, what, or Amon, what did you get? You didn't 15. pass? Oh, yeah. So you just, Nim, give me a uh, wisdom check to recall. Uh, or a, a or a or a harder perception check. Uh, I'll, I think I'll go with the. Per, I'll try the perception of twenty eight. Okay, um, you remember way back um, when you first started uh, adventuring with this group of people, or at least the group of people that were um, when Razbad was still a member, when Akage was still a member, you remember when y'all entered the Dwarven Doors for the first time. Uh, you remember a room before the boss fight in that part of the campaign that had this giant coffin. Um, there was the slab and there was the strange divination magics that were around it. But you never really got a feel for what those divination magics were, but you recognize that from this vision. I will share that with uh, Dorian and Sonder um, and Amon. Oh, uh, I'll share it with everybody, but specifically with them because they were they were there with us mm-hmm. at that time. Mm-hmm. So does that mean this? We're thinking that the so was the so so we think the body or Cromwell's. Well, you know, most Fey or, or especially High Lord Fey are somewhat immortal so he's probably right, so in he's prison bound there. in there hmm? so it was the vision that we just saw inside the dwarven keep yeah well i mean you, you don't know for sure but you're assuming it was it's be hard to move something like that anywhere hmm. else that's interesting too i bet he is mad as balls we how like mad are balls, balls. It depends on whose balls they are, but generally they bounce all any which way, especially rugby or footballs. So the Cromwell that's doing all this wicked shit now is actually rat a tat tat? Possibly. That's Unless they've changed, changed bodies that. again, but you do know that it's not, it, it's probably not Lord Cromwell. Hmm. At that, the door opens, and in the first, this is the first time since you've entered the skull, you see something that is not skull like. You see a very fine set of marble spiraled stairs going up, up into something that's kind of hazy, and you can't really make out what that is. And before it is a statue. The statue uh, looks kind of mundane and unassuming, but the more you look at it, you realize this is like a a younger looking Rotatama, the, the human, but instead of his kind of what I pictured, and I don't know how well I described him to y'all, it's kind of a slendery, wizardy looking, he didn't look evil, but he looked kind of sly. Um, he's got the same features on the face, but this one's like buff and built and like, you know, a Conan the Barbarian sculptured uh, chiseled body. 
but it looks like it's just staring ahead at the entrance to this spiral staircase. Yeah. That was a healthy self-image, self-image I suppose. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Well. I want to go up and uh, examine. Wait. Uh, wizard, to mm-hmm. see if this thing is possibly animated before we try to leave yeah, it. Yeah, I want to do a... Uh, Check to see if it has an evil aura or and or detect magic on it. I don't want anything big and stone following me up the stairs. Is it undead? So just it, just, it is not undead. It does not detect as evil. Um, you do not detect any magic. All right. Can I tie its shoelaces together? Are you going to go up there? <laughs> <laughs> you notice it doesn't wear shoes. No. Tie his toe, toes together, his big toes. Mm. He's got tilapia feet. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Cut him off and make it delicious. He's wearing He's dollar talking. store flip flops. Well, somebody go in. I'll go in if it's not trapped. Uh, I'll go in as well. Come oh, on. Well, have at it. Russian boy. With my weapon and shield up, just so it's clear. Make your way. How how close there? About here. Let's start there. Who else is going in? Bladrost. I will go diagonal one down, closer to the statue. I will look at the statue, prepared to attack it if it. We'll start there. Um. Let's just move me all up a little bit closer, Sonder. Do you want to be on which side of the door? Uh, right there is good. I'll I'm go. sure. I'm sure Nim's happy where he's at, right? Yeah, don't move me. I was good. I'll, I'll go head on in and be diagonal up from new. No, 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 no. You had me here at first. Uh, that's not diagonal up. That's just no, up a one, one more. left. Oh no, you want to be closer than that, Kevin? Nope. That's I'm outside the right blast there. radius. <laughs> exactly. Shit, I'll whip it from there. Why not? Sandra's secretly Man. thinking to herself, which one of us is going to bust their ass on those stairs? Yeah. Whip it. Into shape. Well, before anything else, give shape me a up. perception check. It's true. Uh, those of you that went all the way in the room. Mm-hmm. Hey, that's pretty uh, good. 26. 27. Bitch. One upper. 29. Man, go kill yourself. <laughs> Three up. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a thing kevin okay now um nobody noticed so you mean nobody you noticed suck. you're at you're at, a, you're at a uh surprise when the statue moves quickly and suddenly and strikes out at yeah real surprise uh, ladros who is the closest now <laughs> even though i said i hit it first you're like nope I'm, you know, no. Shenanigans. Shenanigans. If you had went up one more step, it'd be hitting you, noob. Yeah, but I have 20 feet of reach. I'm using it. Yeah. Uh, 36 to hit you, Fricks. Oh, yeah. Sheesh. Yeah. Uh... It did actually move, correct? No. I mean, it... It's it's fist move, but the body didn't move. It would have been impossible for me to see it move. Shenanigans. Yeah, the DC was thirty. Yeah, I have a plus nine. Um. Oh, I was fucking one off. Yeah. Damn. So nineteen damage, and give me a will save. Um, oh. Nineteen. Seconds. And a will save, you say? Oh, that's that's nice. That's a two plus eight. Um, it won't matter if it's an enchantment or a fear effect. So no, because this is strictly for you being hit by this attack. You will be dazed for one round. Dazed. That's no good. If you had saved it, well, it is mind affecting. No, uh, it's it's strictly enchantments. Yeah. Oh. 
What is the wielding toker? The, it's fist. Oh. <laughs> Giant rocks. Yeah. It's stone rocks. As the the fist comes out and, and strikes, its its head turns towards the group, its eyes slowly opening, and inside are pits of nothing. Of of terrifyingly nothing. So like bunny nims eyes. Everybody give me another will save. Except for uh, if you think you can see the creature's face. If I'm dazed, do I still give it a will save? Yes. All right. Well, I got a 30. You're good. I don't think I got my side on I think I could see its face. Is it mind affecting? It is. Oh, wait. So that Uh, is... Is not. Okay, so 23. You're fine. Then. Um, is it if it's fear that is a twenty-two? It's not. All right, then it is a twenty-one. Okay, you're all good. Ten. Um, not you. You are dazed. <laughs> and we'll need to make the save every turn. You can see its face. Um, can I not look at its face? Yeah, it's just like any other. It's like Medusa. You can avert your eyes to give yourself a fifty percent miss chance in the future. You can throw in a blindfold to do the same thing. Uh, so there's ways to get around it. It's just like if you were fighting, you know, any any you know creature of lore that you can't actually look at, or you'll take you'll have to make those saves. Um, but yeah, that's this this big statue comes to life. It's it's pit its eyes pits of of utter terrifyingly madness. And its its feet begin to slowly turn towards the party, and we'll get into this combat next week. Oh, oh, oh man! Now, quick, quick question before we before we leave this this particular vibe. Um, do you, if you pass the save, do you still have to make the save, or is it like every round that you see its face? You every have to round make that you save. have to make the save. Okay. Yeah. So does this mean we've made the save or or failed the save for the first round, or we have to make it again for round one? That's a good question. I should take that note, huh? Mm. Okay. <laughs> now, who 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 made the save? I did. I did. Vladros. I think only Dorian failed. So he's he the one that's going to be really happy that y'all brought this up. Okay. I just wanted to know. Wait, what no, no, it was, it's a good one. So everybody but Dorian, uh, when we roll initiatives, will not be dazed. Uh, so we can act now normally for our first round. Correct. Gotcha. We'll get into the. Thank you, Terrence, for being so enthusiastic with what's happening. Sorry, I'm having a bad night. I can't roll for shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah you've, it's been kind of shitty for you, huh? Well, maybe next week you'll do better. Or in our case, after we take a quick break and come back and record the next episode. In 12 minutes. 12 minutes. I'm going to smoke and get some water and uh, check our... Over to Tritus.com. WWW. Hey, bye. I was going to say, check our Discord. You can, there's a Discord link below if you want to get on our Discord. I think we used to lock it to Patreon, and some of it still is. Uh, so if you want to get on there and see all the goodies, you can join our Patreon at like even just a dollar a month would be fine. You see Thank me you. Nip- if you want to see me nipples, it's on there. Yeah, a dollar a month. That's twelve dollars a year. Nipples. Enough for a pack of smokes and somewhere. <laughs> Bag of smokes and a diet soda, maybe a slim gym, depending on your how rural rural you are. Check out our other shows. Um, we are on. Uh, if if you listen to us on uh, your RSS feed, there may have been some issues and some tweaks and some turnarounds. But as we mentioned at the beginning of the show, move the shit around to save some money because groceries are fucking expensive now. Um, yeah. So thanks for listening. Like, subscribe, push the bell. Send us nudes. You don't have to be attractive. Everybody's attractive in their own way. But please be attractive. I've had the internet for so long, I like just seeing weird shit naked. 
<laughs> weird shit, man. I do too. Yeah. Uh, Send us money, weird shit. Yeah. Weird, weird, Can't weird. wait to see Naked Bunny and them. Put your we tongue know. back in your mouth, you weirdo. All your flavor belong to Napoleon. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>